What's up, y'all? It is B.O. Rames, and it is Nas. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We have a brand new gameplay. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be working on Brandon Smith's house. And this is Brandon Smith. And you guys, if you don't know, we have Nas. Nas is the main builder, the contractor. Nas is also a real estate agent as well. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get right into it and get our crew together so we can finish Mr. Brandon's house. So Nas, let's go ahead and jump into unlocking this house. We're going to give you guys a tour around the area. So on this lot, we have three different homes on the same lot. They have the same floor plan. They have the same layout. The only difference between them is the construction phase is... Okay, that didn't come out right. Okay, the only difference is the construction phases. We have Brandon's house, which is right here. It's almost done. Then we have the Wong's house. The Wong's have not moved in yet. We're still working on construction and framing. And then we have this house right here, which is going to probably stay like this forever because I like to have a construction type gameplay. So we hadn't moved anybody in just yet. So we're gonna always finish this house. The Wong's house is across the street right here. So it's not gonna be done. And then it's gonna mimic the rest of the homes like next door. So this is the model house. It's really nice in the inside, which I can show you guys. And then we have like the second home, and then we have like these homes right here, which are partially done. Once construction is all wrapped up and finished, we're gonna go ahead and make this into like a like a clubhouse. Right now, Nas's little construction trailer is right here. Let's see. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So we get most of the stock and materials all from this site. And then we'll come over here. And we'll work on Brandon's house. So let's go in. Looks like the model is already well the house is already unlocked. So we have a garage, we got some paint cans, we got the kitchen, they got some pot pies. Oh pot pies do sound really good right now. So got a bathroom right here actually there's a full bathroom downstairs okay it's pretty nice so Brandon has two daughters and he didn't bring them with him and Nas has a daughter too and they're all the same age so this is pretty much where the girls are going to this is their little area they know not to go in the pool, so we don't have to put like a privacy fence and the girls can watch themselves. I think they're like, they're like kids, like six and seven. That's what they look like. So we have the Wong's house as well, which is still in construction mode, framing. So we're not gonna worry about that house. We're gonna worry about Brandon Smith's house. So let's go upstairs. So let's see, this is Brandon's room. He has like the master bedroom. We already know what color scheme we wanna go with. We wanna do some nice hardwood floors. And we're gonna give him like a man cave. So his daughter's room is gonna be right here. I was gonna put one daughter here and one daughter here, but I figured like he needs like some soundproofing type rooms because he does a lot of stuff in his room. So, um, yeah, it would be best if the daughters, one room was here, the other one was here. Now, the girls, they share a bathroom, which is right here. This is their bathroom. And this right here is Brandon's bathroom with his walk-in closet. So, we're going to really make this into a really nice home and we're gonna put like, you know, it's gonna be really nice. So we got our gardeners here. They do like landscaping, they clean up around the lot. We got more like plants going in to the whole house or the landscaping. So that's really good. Nas has his construction sign up for the new neighborhood. I really don't like these columns. I like the columns that are on the other 
like the model house or the homes in San Sequoia. I like those a lot better. But we're gonna leave them just like this to kind of mimic the rest of the neighborhood because we don't want to make it look too different because HOA does not like a big difference. So we got some lock, not lock, what is lock? We got some stock. And you know, we got more landscaping. We got some do not enter signs. You know, this is just so construction does not get confused. So we got pools in every lot. So that's good. Let's see. Anything else? Anything else? We got the framing. We got the construction guys out here. So that's pretty good. We got the ladders going on. I think we should go ahead and kind of like get started with this. All right, now. Nah, so go ahead and say hello to everybody. Uh, introduce everybody. We got Ken. Ken lives in Malibu, so he's just here uh, talking to Nas about his house that you know Nas is working on. Nas is working on like three houses at one time. Then we have a painter, which is right here, and then we have a apprentice. He does like carpentry work. So his dad, his dad name is Vante. Vante is not on site yet. And we got Ken's dog. Name, I think the dog name is Heidi. But this is Brandon. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna speak to Brandon. Let's speak to Brandon. Okay, look like we was gonna speak to Brandon. Okay, we can still speak to him. Cause I was gonna say we can just skip this and just head on to the construction. I was just we was just being friendly. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh compliment the client because we always wanna make sure like we are okay, they got too much going on up over here. I don't know what's going on over here. <laughs> so let's go ahead and compliment the client, make sure he's in a good mood. So we may not be able to do all of that. I only think we need to do that, period. So let's go ahead and jump into moving into the house, picking out the furniture, picking out the floors, all of that stuff. Okay, let's just see what they're doing. Not much. Guys, we still gotta get some people out here to do this turf. It's almost 6 a.m. in the morning. So we still waiting on people to come on site. We gotta get the landscapers out here to sort out these plants. Alright, so this is everybody's HVAC system situation. Let's see. So if we all if we ever have a problem, I think we can just go through the side yards, which are right here. This way. Or probably this way, because nobody owns this strip. Through this little alley, nobody owns it, and nobody owns this either. Alright, so... Let's see, Nas nah, is going to go over there. He's going to talk to his client. Alright, so he's talking to the client. Chit-chatting. Talking about more the project that they have going on. And that's what's up. Okay, so we found out that Brandon is very materialistic, so he likes fancy stuff, nice stuff, and I'm really not feeling this to stone, but this is what he picked out, so let's go ahead and finish it. Now, I do want to say that going around the house, it is unfinished, so we're going to go ahead and finish it for him. 
I can't wait to get on the inside. Like, I am so ready to get on the inside. Maybe give it, like, a new color or something. Because I think all the other homes are, like, white. This is, like, when we first started. Like, yeah, we had first started. And I think all the homes are white. And I kind of don't want just, like, a white house anymore. finish this one on out gosh I do not like the basic white house it's not ugly but it's not like nice looking either I want to give him like a blue house or something let's just be different <laughs> for once right, I might be feeling this blue a little bit it's probably going to be another repaint Brandon seems to change his mind a lot, so I don't even know if he's going to even like this and stick with it. Because this is like the fourth time. I'm definitely not, we're not feeling this blue. I don't think Brandon's going to be feeling this blue either. Gosh, this is an ugly blue. Yeah, we ain't feeling that blue. See? stuck the regular stuff that he already had. Let's see. I'm thinking we probably should have just kept it the way that it was. starting to get some trouble already. I guess that's looking nice so far. these homes are going for okay so these homes are 156,000 a piece so if you have been in the sense of Koya video if you watch that those are 92,000 so these at 150,000 yeah and these are a lot bigger too you get like more land over here in San Sequoia San Sequoia you don't really get that much land so yeah so it's kind of like bang for your buck you get more out here anyway all right so i picture this place is probably like texas or somewhere maybe like houston or dallas that's what it's kind of like giving me so we're gonna go with that all right okay i like this color so far If it is like kind of giving like gingerbread house vibes, you know, it's not that bad. I just want that blue to go away. Should have nothing to change, but that don't even match. All right, let's see. Are these really the same? 
swatches can't be they are the same swatches some reason it's just strange oh okay okay so they they are okay i thought i was thought it was going crazy for a little bit all right i can kind of work with this i think brandon would like this gotta change this part up here yeah i think that's gonna look nice looks nice Go ahead and bring the turf people out here. Get the landscapers. All right, so we're only going to finish half of this. Starting to look good so far. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and delete the ladder. I do think we can change the roof. I think it need to be like brown or This is definitely different. We're definitely not doing this. That's gonna go against the houses in HOA. Are all of these tile? Yeah, all of the tile. You want those? Hmm. Alright, I'm feeling this a little bit. It's decent enough. I think Brandon will like that. So one thing I am begging Brandon is to change the brick or the stone. I'm not really feeling that either. y'all think y'all feeling that i'm feeling that i'm feeling it a little bit i'm gonna go ahead and go with that you don't look that bad <laughs> all right let's see Maybe something like that get a little bit of, of difference i don't know my back's Brandon. I don't like it. We ain't gonna add it. Right. So let's see what else. Let's go ahead and paint the walls. Okay, one of the girls wanted a pink room and another girl wanted a green room. Okay, 
Okay, so one of the girls can go to lavender room. The other girl, she wanted the green room. Actually, we're gonna come back to that. All right, let's go ahead and So far, so good. So let's fix this. Let's go like this. So apparently there's nothing wrong with that. That's just how that is, how that looks, okay. So I guess now what we can do is move everything over because Brandon is actually about to like move in. All right, that moving truck. I don't know where we're gonna put that moving truck at. So maybe Brandon plays a little bit of golf. Probably getting like a golf course area right here. So I'm gonna move the pallets on over here. Still got construction going on. Let's go ahead and take away the scaffolding. Probably put the paint tools probably somewhere else. So far, I think we like this. Okay, so we missed a window, obviously. This house has a lot of windows. We really got a lot of doors, too. Way too many doors to change. Let's go ahead and pick up this floor. 
Netflix. We're gonna do some nice towel in the kitchen. I think that'll be nice. I guess we can work with those. Those aren't that bad. I think Brandon's gonna make us change those anyway. So it don't matter. <laughs> Ooh, I like these. I think you like these a lot better. Nah, I thought I was, but I don't. We don't like those either. So we're probably not gonna choose those. Like, what's a good towel to go with? Oh, I like, I think Brandon might like this. Yeah, that looks so much better. I like that dark one. Splash, the towels, all those good things. I'm trying to go off of that model house in San Sequoia. That one is really nice. I think this will work for Brandon because he's like a male, masculine energy. So we're probably going to maybe repaint the cabinets too. Let's see, what is this? What's going on with this? What does this look like? Definitely not feeling that. I don't think Brandon will be feeling that one either. He probably has to change it all over. Be like another do over. Okay, they got different ones to choose from on this one. They got like any thing that's dark that does match. Okay, probably gonna go for this. All right, I don't really like that. I don't think Brandon's gonna like that either. But let's see what else they got. They got some browns. They have anything like black? This, this is better. Although I'm not really feeling it like that, but it's gonna be what it's gonna be. Alright, so we need that one accent wall type of a room. It's workable. 
It is definitely workable. But I... Oh, I'm not really sold on it. So I don't think Brandon is going to be sold on it either. Let's see what else they got. Nope. Not feeling it. They decent. Those are decent, but it's probably enough for those two. Nope. Nah, not feeling. Definitely not. I would like these if they was darker, though. I don't even like that. I think I like the color the most. That's what we did like. I'm just not feeling these either. Definitely not feeling those. I thought I was, but I wasn't. I think I like between that one. Those are just too light though. Okay, but these are these are alright. I think we're gonna go with these. So we got the painters painting most of the rooms. Oh, I forgot to let you guys know, like we do have upstairs washer and dryer. So that's upstairs, it's not in a garage or anything. So it's always good. All right, let's go ahead and um, let's get some drapes. See, should I, should I raise these? I think they'll be alright. Have to raise them. Oh, but they do got different colors. I didn't even think of that. But I think we're gonna keep everything like neutral with brown. so much better yeah I'm definitely not feeling this tile alright so this is gonna be for little girls so probably gonna do like a girly color white is fine alright 
So we're gonna go ahead and um, see. Can we get like some black tiles or something? some subway tile. Alright, we might have to work with that. That's not like the best looking, but it's not the worst either. Wait, this might work. Okay. I want whatever they got on that wall though. Shower wall, I like. Nope, I don't like. Let's see, can this work? What y'all think? Y'all think this work? Yeah, this is why Brandon is gonna have us do more change orders than we even need to be doing. We ain't gonna worry about that too much. Okay, we probably just gonna change out his bath bathroom. Alright, so we don't like that either. Maybe so. Could be. Probably. Probably not. Wait, they got this. Okay, definitely not what we wanted, but it's this. Oh, this is it. Yep. I think we feeling that a little bit better. Better than this tile. I don't. I don't really like that. Alright, I think that's going to be what that's going to be. And plus it go with the floor. Alright, but we're probably going to change this bedroom, this bathroom, like pink or something. like Because it's, it's a girl bathroom. And he has two girls. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and... We're just gonna choose like another light color. Alright, one is lavender, the other one can be like a green or something. Gosh. I like playing with color, but I really don't. Especially when it comes to kids. Like I don't really don't do like kid rooms and stuff like that. So yeah. That's something about me. I'm gonna have to get used to like playing with color and stuff. Alright. So let's see what else. I feel like Brandon needs to have. Let's see. Lavender. Nope. Not for him. Let's see. We need to give him like a masculine, like a blue. I'm definitely feeling like a blue. Blue is like nice. So we're going to give him like a blue room or something with like an accent wall. I think like. I like gray. Yeah, I think all of the walls need to be gray. We just feeling gray. And yeah, I'm feeling gray for like everything up in this house. Strange. I know who is feeling gray. Alright, so far I like this. So far. You know, he had to go through a lot of trials and tribulations. Oh, snap. They took away the... They took that away, too? Wow. When I said I wanted all the walls gray, I didn't mean it like that. Okay, now I'm not lying. This is ugly. I don't even like that. I think we just gonna choose all of the walls. This We're not gonna try to even make anything different up in this house. Because that would be yet another change for it. So there's nothing there to change. Next 
test it out. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and pick out the carpet. Hopefully Brandon likes this carpet. I feel like we don't need to really go over the board with the carpet. We just need something that's durable, something that's gonna last long, and that looks nice. That's the most important. It has to look cohesive and very nice. So, uh, this carpet looks old. We definitely not the most old looking carpet, but it could work. Oh, I like this. I think it's gonna be it. Let's look at a few more light colors. Maybe we get like a gray carpet or something. All right. How y'all feeling? Y'all feeling this? Cause I'm not really feeling that like I thought I was. No, I'm not. Okay, I like this, but I don't like it. It's just giving me old vibes. Nope. Nah. All right, so we're not feeling any of these. We're gonna go ahead and go for that. So Brandon room is gonna have carpet in it. Uh, we need to put some carpet in this closet. And we're gonna do carpet for this room and carpet for this room. So we also wanna do carpet for this room. The other rooms are okay. So, all right, so eventually, well, what was supposed to happen was the two girls his two twin daughters, they both wanted a room that would overlook this castle, the Playhouse Castle. I actually might put his daughter rooms right over there. Yeah, and this could be his office space. Let's go ahead and do that. So let's transition. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep it with the storyline, make it very cohesive. We're gonna put his office right here. Yeah, that's gonna be Brandon's office over there. Cause these rooms are about the same size. And they both have a closet that we gonna switch out for a different style of closet. Let's go ahead and take those away. And let's go to the wardrobe closet. And let's go ahead and choose that. like that I don't think I like that too much I'm gonna go back to what we had and I don't like that it's the daughter's room next door either because this should have been his office space right here definitely should be his office space but I do like the hardwood floors I just don't know if I like it upstairs Let's give him some 
let's put hardwood floors in his room. He's going to get that in his room and in the office. In fact, we might even open the office space. Yeah, I think that would be nice. Put in like a little desk right here. But we just happen to open it up. Yeah, I think that's going to look really nice right there. So we're probably going to move this ladder. Probably put this... We're going to have to come in there anyway. Put it in here. Paint it. Paint cans can go in there too. Right. Actually, we're going to put all of the paint stuff in the garage. Even though it all will get moved out of the garage. It's fine. Alright, so, so far, I like what we have. This is... Nice. Only thing I don't like is the little girls' rooms. I, I just don't like girls and how they look. Alright, so we're gonna move all of this stuff on over. Alright, we're gonna put the coolers. Alright, this is like it's a hot day out, so we're gonna put like a cooler in the back. So let's put this little vacuum thing and put this in the mom's house. Alright, so so far, let's take this trash can out. Like I think like we are getting a lot of stuff done. So the fellas can finish up their lunch somewhere else. I don't know who had the Popeyes. Let's see, but I think that's the only place Popeyes can go. So we'll go ahead and trash the Popeyes. Food has been sitting on the countertop for a while. Nobody wants to get sick. It's like, what else do I do now? Like, where else do we go? I guess we're gonna start with uh, easy stuff. Let's go ahead and move this ladder somewhere else. I feel like I got too much paint on the fly anyway. So I'll probably move everything over on this side. Stack it up over here. So we're gonna go ahead and attempt to do Brandon's bedroom. Alright, so we need a masculine bed. Go ahead and get this bed spread. I think that's gonna look nice. Put like some pillows on that bed. That. Alright, so let's see. Can't get no more masculine than that. I think that's gonna look really nice. Yup, that 
it already looks nice. Let's go ahead and change some of this stuff. Yeah, I like that already. That looks really nice. Probably put like I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to move the little girls' room over. I think this needs to be his office space. Well, them little girls, they probably not to share a room. That's probably gonna be the best bit for them. They're not to share a room. Cause you know we gotta have like a guest room. Like we don't have like no guest room at all. I don't think we need one anyway. Probably put like a dresser right here. Feeling the dressing, but I'm feeling the dressing. Oh, wait, there's a design on that? I'm definitely not feeling that. Okay, I probably wouldn't put this in that room, but it's nice though. It might work. It, it gives faux leather, but we're gonna go ahead and not get it. decent enough it's not like all of that in a bag of chips but it's all right for what he's going for and what we're going for let's put this thing maybe okay I, I think i'm feeling that maybe put like a nice mirror or something on the wall Back to the closet stuff, we don't really know just yet what we're gonna do with that. But if they got that in black, this could work. Alright, so they don't have it in black, so that's not gonna work. But that's okay. Oh, I'm feeling this. Put that right there. Let's start with the easy stuff and tables. I feel like you can't go wrong with that. I like that, but that's just too small. Too big. Unique. It's, it's nice. Nope, I'm not feeling it. If I had to, I would definitely have done this if I had to. <laughs> I'm gonna put this out there just in case. That's gonna give like more construction appeal right there. Alright, so I 
and black yeah I don't want to make this more difficult than it needs to be we have these in black I like those better though they don't have them in black So I think this is supposed to match. All right, which one y'all like best? Cause I already see which one I like best. Let's see. So let's put a lamp on it. Let's see which one looks best with the lamp. That's how you can really tell. Like once you put like a lamp on it. That's how you really know which is the best. Okay, so far I'm definitely feeling. Hold on, let's go back. They got this in black. They do. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not feeling this side. It's, it looks like too modern. Like I'm not feeling it, but I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this a lot. This is giving very like rooms to go type vibes. Okay, I like that. Too black. Okay, so we're gonna switch it up, play with a little bit of colors. Alright, so we're gonna go with the winner. Unfortunately, they ain't that. Okay, now let's see how this would look though if I was to pair it up and to match it. I know I'm gonna look back at this recording, I'm gonna be like, man, I probably should have kept it the way I had it. It was, you know, nice. Okay, what about this lamp? Hey, it depends. Can we change the lamp shade color? Can't. So we can't do anything with that. Alright, so I feel like I feel like maybe a TV should have been on this wall or something, but that's alright. Alright, so we just missing a dresser for this room and maybe a rug. Okay, rugs be like the worst. Cause they just got so many to choose from. Oh, they got some some okay ones. I think this is nice, it's modern, it's masculine. Mm, it's also too much going on with that pattern though. All right, I'm kind of feeling this so far. It ain't like the best, but it ain't the worst either. Okay, 
Okay, so I feel like Brandon is more of a uh, um, a recliner type of a guy. So he's probably gonna have a recliner in that room. Let's just put this there. That just looks decent. Although I'm not really feeling that. That's gonna be one of the things to change out. And I want him to have like a circular um, dining table right here. How did we even get here? Like, we're supposed to be upstairs. We aren't even finished yet. Now that would be perfect if it didn't come out too far. So the only problem with that Bushes, thinking like a tall plant or something. Something like this, but without this ugly base. So that's not perfect, but it's going to be what it's going to be. In fact, I actually like this better. That plant does look a little dead. It really do. Let's see what else can we choose from? And what are the choices? Alright, we got this. Perfect. It's ugly, but it's perfect. 
is definitely giving that masculine type of vibe that you know Brandon is and Brandon is going for. Oh, I like this even better. This is way better. Let's see how I'm feeling that one. I feel like I like that one, but I feel like not for that space though. Alright, so I feel like I would like it, but maybe for like something like over here, probably. Alright, so we're gonna move this fan. We're just gonna put everything up in here. They got a lot of good plant selections though, they really do. kind of feeling that just a little bit not a lot sell that one although that one was nice I feel like that's just better probably put like a It's gonna be all right. Put some more paintings on the wall, but I think that's that's it for Brandon's room so far. Uh, back to the closet. Not really a fan of that. Something like this. Dang, it's too small. But I can do this. That's perfect. I'm not even gonna complain about this. Alright, so I definitely feel like his room is missing some stuff Just putting some shoes in his closet. We ain't gonna go like all out for this though. I'm gonna tell you that right now.
thought he was gonna be able to like put some more stuff on a dresser, but we don't really have any, a lot of choices. something right here besides the hat. I'm not feeling that hat there either. Alright, we need maybe some books. No guy stuff, like need some guy stuff there. Alright, where can we put Brandon's bathrobe at though? That's the question. So we still haven't found out where to put the stuff at. Alright, I don't know what this is, but it looks pretty interesting. Yo, that looks real interesting. It looks better than having this hat there. We're gonna sell the hat. Gonna go ahead and put that there. Perfect. Stairs. Uh, definitely, probably going to start with. Let's start with like the dining stuff. I like the dining room stuff. Hmm, what's this? I've never seen a table like this before. I wish they had like a glass table. I would probably put that here if they had like a glass round table. That would have been perfect if they had a glass round table. too many tools on the lot I'm gonna go ahead and just start the beat as I go although it took me a while to find that stuff I 
it. So let's go ahead and put like a few chairs. They got some black chairs. They got black chairs. We are in the game. Yeah, they do. I don't think we need about six. We don't need that many. But it's good to know that they have that many. Alright, I think that would look good right there. Clean up crew stuff can go like over in this one. Let's move this here. Actually, I don't like that there. For now, we're just gonna move this stuff on over here. I think we need to start with the little girls' rooms upstairs. Okay, what are some good toys for, for little girls? I don't know, like, do they play with this stuff on the game? I have no clue. All right, probably put like a dinosaur in everybody's room or something. But I do like how they can go between each other's rooms. So that could be a good thing too. Maybe give one little girl that. Perfect. Let's see what's all this stuff. This can go in the daddy room. <laughs> I'm just trying to be funny though, but literally it probably can't go in his room. And it is gonna go in his room. He likes zebras. Alright, this is ugly, but whatever. Alright, this is ugly, but whatever. Okay, I was feeling that, but I'm not. Alright, so what do the girls need in their room? Okay, 
good. I'm glad they got these as options because um because I definitely had no clue of what to do. So we're definitely going to put this in the dad's room. Probably put this right here. I mean, I kind of think that's it. Probably put the girls like a mirror or something on the wall. I think that's going to be a lot better. Unless, let's see. Let's make this an interesting one. is exactly why we're not painting right here because we don't even know what color it would be so I'm fine with it being gray right. but what about this side hmm, we can fix this by doing a couple of things another wall there. I think that's gonna look so much better. How y'all like that? Y'all like that? I don't know what it is, but lately I've been getting these single family homes with single parents. I don't know what, what's going on with that. Alright, so we're gonna give Brandon a desk
actually I'm gonna put like a, a den up here. like comfortable sofa right here too it don't even have to be like fancy it just needs to be like i know when i see it let's see if you use this I feel like that's nice, but that's not the one I'm looking for. Yeah, we need the leather sofa. That would have been perfect, but it doesn't go all the way on the back of the wall. Sorry, that's not all of that. All right, how y'all feeling? Y'all feeling this? I feel like it was nice, but. on whether or not this is symmetrical. Let me do something like that. Uh, I'm not feeling this. Like I thought I was. Probably gonna put like a stereo. Yeah, Brandon definitely is like the surround sound type of a dude, so I'm probably not gonna go for that one. Let's see, what is this one? It's got a TV on it. Why does it carry open the shit? Definitely don't need that.
Okay, now I would do that. Or I could shrink this one down. Like I said, that was just too big. I'm feeling that. So, so far we've gotten uh, all the upstairs furnished completely. We just missing the rug. Probably put some rugs in their rooms too. Probably need to put something else right here. That's ugly. I don't think that's nice. That's an ugly for the space. I feel like this is just too much black. But we're gonna leave just because it's very like masking. It's, it's masking, so we're gonna leave it. Although we could try something like this. I, I actually like this a lot better. I like that so much better. I feel like the other one is just it's too much. something
So let's see if we can go ahead and put some mirrors there. We need mirrors on the wall. Let's see, let's see this one. I think these girls are too grown for these type of mirrors. But we're gonna put them in there anyway. I think that's nice. Y'all think that's nice? Like give them like matching mirrors. Okay, so far I'm, I'm kind of feeling their room. They got a nice room so far. And they get a third window. Let's see, can we put like a little chair? Give the girls like a little chair or something in the room. Maybe a bookshelf too. That might be nice. You want to be smart. I feel like the whole house is missing a bookcase. Because that bookshelf definitely would have went here. Okay, so we ain't got enough room for this, this mirror. Although I was really feeling that mirror, but it just wouldn't raise. So that's all right. So now what else is really kidding me here that we get that's tall enough? something on top or maybe put a toy on top some pictures on top. Got no other stuff like no okay they're gonna fight over the tablet all right you know they're gonna fight over it so you know when you give one girl one you gotta give the other girl one because they're gonna fight over the tablets should have gave them some car beds <laughs> that would be so much better than these beds they got already too but I think we're gonna stick to what we have I need to get a pet they look like they might need a pet or something give them like a hamster or something I think giving them a hamster would be good too and 
this will actually be like my first time giving anybody like some pet stuff. I think this can go in the living room. Yeah, I think for Brandon's house, he's not really worried about like style or anything because you know he's a single father and he has you know, two little girls, so you know we just gonna put stuff anywhere. for that to be the first thing that you see when you walk into the house though. We're gonna put it right there. It's gonna be ugly, but hey, it's gonna be out of the way. I was hoping that just gonna curl around like I wanted it to. That's not. Actually, it will. Okay. So, ugh, this house is ugly, but it's not ugly. But I think this is good because this house don't have to be like perfect. All right, so this is going to be Brandon's bike. Got two little girls, so they gonna need a bike too. All 
All right, so so far I'm not feeling the downstairs look. I'm really not. So let's go ahead and throw another TV on the wall. I feel like Brandon, they have a nice house, but I feel like their house is like missing so much. Like, so much is missing out of this house. That would be so ugly to put that right there, but this is how you gonna keep his girls in track. That's their little chore board. Everybody does a chore. 